We're reaching the end of an era. Beanox have just announced that the next Grand Prix in Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled will be the last. But that does not mean it is the end. We do not yet know what the track is going to be or what's going to be added in terms of characters and whatnot. But we do know that there is going to be more after this Grand Prix. But we don't know exactly when or how it's going to work. So basically, um, the race continues as soon as the final Grand Prix ends with a brand new challenge system. This system gives any driver the opportunity to master challenges, earn Wampa Coins and further customise their experience with items in the pit stop. There will be challenges relevant to all game modes so players can race and play Crash Team Racing Nitro Field the way they enjoy the most. Three challenge types will remain active, daily, weekly and pro challenges. Um, the pro challenges I think will vary monthly. Uh, completing challenges will give ver players varying amounts of Wampa Coins that they can use in the pit stop, which is really, really great. The pit stop will feature items from each Grand Prix season. Uh, players will be able to view a variety of items by refreshing pit stop screen up to two times per day to give them more daily options to choose from when they're customising the nitro fueled experience, which is pretty nice. Oxide is no longer the king of the track. Going live after the final Grand Prix, there will be a set of time trial records that will be a challenge for even the best players of Crash Team Racing to beat. These track times will be based on some of the best times achieved by the Beanox team on each individual track. So the challenge is posed for the best racers out there. Can you beat Beanox? I love the idea of this. It is awesome. Um, it doesn't specify exactly when this is going live. It implies it's going to be after this Grand Prix. So maybe a couple of weeks, maybe a month. I don't know. Or maybe as the next Grand Prix launches. I'm sure we'll find out in a couple of days. But by beating all the Beanox times on the tracks, you will unlock a special reward that will let others know you've got some serious Crash Team Racing skills. And apparently there is additional planned post Grand Prix content. Whilst the final Grand Prix is approaching, there will still be more items coming to Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. So new characters apparently, new carts, new legendary skins, legendary skin recolors, that's new and very exciting. New decals, new paint jobs, that's pretty cool. That does mean that if Velo isn't added to this one, then maybe in the future, uh, a bunch of additional Spyro characters could be added. If a new Crash game is announced and there are new characters in that Crash game revealed, maybe they could be put into this as a lot, sort of like, hey, you know they're coming, well, here you go. You know, it's who knows what could happen next. But I just want to say thank you so much, Beanox. It has been an absolute joy to play Crash each month and I'm gonna still keep playing. I love Crash Team Racing Nitro Field. I play it most days, obviously if I'm away I can't, but you know, I, I do just play online for a bit each day. It's still super fun for me and I just love it. I love that I love the amount of additions that they've added to the game, like the ring rally is great, that's something that no one actually expected. The fact that you can customise the playstyle for any character, a really welcome addition, it's wonderful, it's just so, so wonderful. Crash Team Racing is an experience that I just absolutely adore and yeah, I really want to thank Beanox for all their hard work and I look forward to seeing what they do next. So. Yeah, thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, leave a like, subscribe, share the video around, and I'll see you soon for the final Grand Prix and whatever they have in store for us in Crash Team Racing Nitro Field. Take care, bye bye.